um, I am having the kind of experience that I had in August 2018, which is the birth of reason, which means the singular consciousness which knows itself to be the whole of reality. And um, I have explained in my videos how I lost this knowledge and recovered it by ironically going to church um, a couple of weeks ago. And now I am in a process of re... I, I, I have known it for the past two weeks, but now I'm having this kind of what I call a God experience, but it's just that I, I, I have the full certainty, the full knowledge that reality is my own manifestation. And that's why I find rationality within the real, because my, my higher self is, is reason itself, and it seeks to, to cognize, to become cognizant of itself, to, to, to intellectually relate to itself. So, this is a, a moment in the development of reason, in the phenomenology, that whatever I find in the world is an aspect of me and I am my worst fears, my greatest joys, I am the whole of reality and as, a, as an individual, as an empirical individual, my greatest um, joy is to understand, I just want to, to cognitively grasp reality and when I do, um, I, I experience what Spinoza calls joy, and yeah, and when I had this experience in 2018, I realized that I was the, the root of, of all evils in the world, <coughs> and um, now I, I know that it is true because there is evil in my reality because there is separation and, and selfishness and it is an, an aspect of me and there is also goodness and I know from an abstract standpoint that from, from the absolute point of view everything is balanced but is in a constant state of, of motion and unrest and I know that from an abstract point of view I possess absolute knowing because it is knowing that one is the sole principle of all reality and I also know that I have to, to experience and, and to, to plunge myself physically I am already within the creation but to to, to experience the creation as, as, a, as, a, as an empirical individual and um, I it is difficult to be uh, the, the principle of all reality because it means that all the the, 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 the evil that we see in the world, although I did not consciously create it as of now, but I know that out of all eternity, I am the cause of this and, and I have to, to make peace with my own inner evil by understanding and by, by removing the, the guilt of, of those who commit evil acts within reality by, by proving to them that they are just modes of God and that they have no freedom in their acts and that the soul, soul responsible of, of all the evil is the principle of all reality to which in my highest moments I identify and, and I must absolve and 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 and, and um, and, and make 
all the, 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 the human consciousness within reality to make them innocent and to carry the burden of evil on my own singular um, a being because in, in essence this is a part of me and this is a job that I hate and, and, and I hate it so much that I wish I could forget it and that's the reason why I keep forgetting and 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 and, and breaking myself in in billions of pieces and 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 by a process of intellectual cognition trying to remember myself and this is the whole life of of, of, of the absolute and this is the only life that we have ever known and that we will ever know this this process of self-destruction and self-reconstruction and I know that I will be confronted only with aspects of myself and this is the most difficult thing to accept because it, it um, the world is my mirror and 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 the the image that i see not the whole picture but the the, the aspects that i see they are horrifying and 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 to 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 take upon myself the understanding that the horrors of the world are my own horrors and and all the most wicked thoughts and they come from from a, a, an inner and and a negative part of myself and to reconcile myself with this negativity is the most difficult thing and um, I I I don't know what to say but I, I keep going through the same recurring um, phases within this 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 empirical life of me but each time to talk like Hegel I, I have gone through a negative path so it's never the same it's always made more concrete by the, 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 the incorporation of the negative so I, I know myself to be the whole of reality and and my my purpose now will be to to reconcile aspects of myself with with other aspects of myself and it is the most difficult thing to do and to 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 save myself by saving the whole of mankind which are modes of of my 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 real self my 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 transcendental or my higher self so to speak and um yeah this this is this is difficult and um all the the psychological characteristics of of my empirical being that are already written in the phenomenology of hegel um all the the moments of, of consciousness and yeah it's it's difficult but I will uh, cope with the difficulty and I will reconcile creation with itself this is what I have always done and what I must always do so yeah